Suppose you've set up a model, began uploading daily profiles, and configured your monitoring and alerting settings. One day, you find some alerts through email, pager duty, or maybe Slack, depending on how you configured your alerts. You're relieved that the issue was caught early, but now what? How can you begin the troubleshooting process without spending precious time meticulously coming through huge datasets? Over the next few videos, we'll see how YLab's input view and profile comparison features can help. Clicking on a model takes you directly to the inputs page. My selected date range is January 28th through February 3rd. I can see a count of the number of alerts for each feature, along with a simple time series plot for each of the monitored metrics. For this all util feature, we can see that there was one alert within the selected date range, and the red highlighting indicates that this alert was triggered by the null fraction monitor on January 28th. However, my most recent alert points to an issue with the number of revolving accounts feature. We see that the monitors for distribution distance and estimated unique values were triggered. I can get a more detailed view of these monitored metrics by clicking on the feature. This first widget plots the distribution distance of each dataset as compared to the sliding window or reference profile that we are monitoring against. The median, min, max, and upper and lower quartiles provided by the uploaded profiles are also included. The distribution distance is the light blue line which we see spiking on February 3rd. From this plot, it looks like the distribution may have narrowed significantly judging by the convergence of the min, max, and upper and lower quartiles. In addition to the distribution distance, we can see a time series plot of individual statistics. The next widget shows a count of missing values, which doesn't seem to be an issue here. We do also see a big drop in the unique value count for this feature. As for the inferred data type, there doesn't seem to be an issue here since all the values have been inferred as the fractional data type across the state range. Next, we'll see how the profile comparison feature can help us drill down even further in search of a root cause for these alerts.